Hey guys, back with another video. I'm uh, going to be doing a uh, sound demo as promised of the Sono 7.2.4 uh, sound system. Uh, this is with the Sonos Era 300s. And I have uh, placed over here. We're still waiting on the stands. But uh, I'm going to do a comparison of the sound quality first of the full system. This is going to be with uh, the TV audio. Now I'm going to try to get the same type of uh, sound uh, level to make it as fair as possible. Uh, this is not this is by no means a scientific, uh, you know, analysis of, you know, the exact sound quality. This is more to just give you an idea of the difference that you can expect with a full Sono setup as opposed to, um, you know, traditional TV speakers. So uh, without further ado, here we go. Entirely too eventful. Well, I admit it was a bit like old times there for a moment. The fearless navigating some hitherto unhappened upon patch of forest. In a while since you joined us, if that's what you mean. Ah, well, I'm just tired, I suppose. You've seen one deer hunt, you've seen them all. How can you feel tired when you never sleep? There are other kinds of tired, lad. You'll see when you're older. Now have a proper rest, my brother. Things are always Evenings go, that was entirely too eventful. Though I admit it was a bit like old times there for a moment. The three of us navigating some hitherto unhappened upon patch of forest. In a while since you've joined us, if that's what you mean. Ah, well, I'm just tired, I suppose. You've seen one deer hunt, you've seen them all. How can you feel tired when you never sleep? There are other kinds of tired, lad. You'll see when you're older. The ball. Alright guys, that was uh, just a quick little demo of uh, what this system can do, you know, in comparison to your TV speakers. I, I did want to touch on one thing about the Sonos Aero 300 though. I noted in my previous uh, video on these that it seemed almost as if this front tweeter was not producing any sound when it came to surround purposes. And uh, I found that out to be true. I haven't seen a lot of people talk about this. So for surround duty, I guess these speakers only shoot sound from the sides giving you a type of uh, bipole type speaker so uh, what that means is basically you're not going to be hearing surround activity directly towards your ears it's going to be more spread out you know towards the sides of the speaker uh, personally I actually prefer it it uh, makes everything sound uh, wider and um, you can't really tell where the sound is coming from you can just tell that it's coming from you know the left side of you but you can't tell specifically where on the left side of you is coming from i prefer over the zones ones but that is something to take note of um i still i'm having a great time with these speakers and i did i just received the sonos era 100 
which I um, I'm still figuring out where to place it right now. I'm probably gonna get um, one more of those. For now, I think I actually am gonna keep it in my bathroom, and uh, it sounds amazing. So do these speakers, special with Dolby Atmos. The right Dolby Atmos songs will really impress you with with uh, the system. All right, guys. Well, if you guys like this video, uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you guys have uh, any ideas for any other videos you might want to see, uh, whether it be Sonos products or any other type of uh, system or speakers or anything you guys are interested in, leave it down in the comments below, and I'll try to get to it as soon as I can. I'll uh, definitely be looking out for any more Sonos products that are going to be coming out in the next few months. I believe a Sonos uh, Move 2 is coming out uh, late in late this summer, so I'm uh, definitely going to be picking that up. But uh, for now, um, I'll see you guys in the next one, and uh, thank you guys for watching.